Hello everybody, welcome back, C-Ray Tech here. Today I'm going to show you guys the Betaflight OSD configuration for the Beta 65, I'm sorry, Beta 75 with OSD. So the first thing you want to do is make sure you've got Betaflight. Um, I'm using version 321. Um, we're going to go ahead and plug in the USB. Alright. So we got our drone plugged in. So we're going to go up here in the corner and click connect. And then we'll go to OSD. Here in your OSD you can see this is how I have mine set up. I'm currently using main battery voltage, my fly time, craft name, current draw, and milliamp hour draw. All you have to do is turn these sliders on and you can set all of your um, locations on the screen. So if you want to have your name at the top, you just drag it to the top. Um, I keep mine towards the bottom because the um, values that I see on my monitor on my screen um, would overlay these so you wouldn't be able to see anything. So um, as long as your quadcopter supports these, you shouldn't have any reason turning them on. Uh, for the craft name, once you turn that on, if you want to make any changes with that, you just go to your configuration tab. We'll scroll down just a little bit. Oops. And you'll see personalize here. Under craft name, you can go ahead and put your name in there. Uh, so that's pretty much it. Uh, the big thing is you want to make sure you save it um, at the end, and then it'll be there in real time. In fact, if you plug in uh, your goggles or you have a monitor available and your camera powers on when you plug it in through the USB, you can see this in real time. As you add this and move it around, it'll show up right on the screen. So you'll be able to get a good idea of where everything's positioned. So if you guys have any questions or anything, just feel free to leave me a comment. Uh, if you want to know anything more about Betaflight and my current configurations for the Beta 75, definitely let me know. I haven't been doing too much pit tuning or anything, but I wouldn't have any problems you know, showing anybody who needs any help with that. So uh, I think that's going to be all for me today. So as always, fly safe and fly often. Remember to like and subscribe. And uh, yeah, have a good one, guys.